but I'm delighted to be working again with you, buddy. <laughs> Have you remember 1978, by, the song by Peaches and Herb, Reunited and I do. Few. Seven turnovers combined in their last two losses, and they're tracking the number today again that's hard to win on the road. Good matchup here, right? And backing in saw, John Paul gets it, and the foul. It's couple. Drops in a tough shot, and he's fouled. He and Jackson, two of the guys Coach Cow said we're going to play through if we can, more often than the outside shots. Bounce pass, Curtis is right on the baseline, flushes it in. It can carry Kentucky early right now to the young guys find their feet. But it's, uh, you, you got to play through those two. Jump shot from four, and that was a set play out of that break. Sure is. The two number fives have been dominant. Let's see what Kentucky does out of that half. A lot of times, Calipari, terrific at adjustments. And we've seen Georgia Tech in a zone. They're in a zone again, and then some laziness on the other end. <laughs> to in the paint, too easy. Baseline flush and another one. Why Kentucky got the ball back. And then they ran out of time on the shot clock and an air ball from Clark. Great cut and a nice drop off as Alvarado lays it up and in. Getting you off the bounce going both directions and around the rim. He still has not fumbled the ball. Askew left his feet. Turnover. Right. Wide open three. Georgia Tech. Top 10 teams night after night. It's just a... There's a lot of question marks for Big Blue Nation right now. A three on two leads to a turnover and a Georgia Tech dunk. Old wins national championships, old wins conference championships. We've seen over the last few years and uh, Georgia Tech's experience impressive today.